Greetings and welcome to the Astronomy Picture of the Day podcast. Today's picture for May 28th of 2024 is titled Solar X Flare as Famous Active Region Returns. So what do we see here? Well, this is a video clip and we'll take a look at it and put it on a repeat so you can see it cycle through as we discuss it a little bit. And this is actually showing the return of the famous active region on the sun known as AR 3664. Now we looked at that earlier this month as it gave some very massive solar flares and coronal mass ejections that gave us some very fabulous aurora here on Earth a few weeks ago. Now because the sun rotates that takes the active region out of view of the Earth for a couple of weeks. And in fact the sun takes roughly a little less than a month to rotate one time. So for a couple of weeks it's going to disappear along the side and we kind of wondered how long that region would last and would it reappear. And that's what we're seeing here. We're seeing that reappearance on the lower left side of the very active region with some of those very strong flares that it's flinging out as it comes back around the limb of the sun. Now they're still not heading toward Earth. That'll take it another few days until that region rotates to the forward surface of the sun. So it's quite possible that we could get additional aurora, very strong aurora coming up in the next week or two. So here we can see some of that. Now the image that we're looking at is from the Solar Dynamics Observatory, which is out in orbit and looks at the sun. And because the sun looks a little weird here, that's just because we're looking in ultraviolet light. So it has to be false color image to give something that we can see. So you'll see various solar dynamics images depending on which wavelengths they're looking at. But this one is we're looking at the very highest energy solar flares. So solar flares can be classified. And this is classified as an X class solar flare, which is the strongest solar flare, giving the most amount of energy that will occur. So those are the very strongest. And that's what we're looking at with this one. So what will happen when it continues? Well, we don't know. Could there be more solar flares and stronger ones? The X flares coming directly toward Earth could cause significant issues uh, with strong radiation storms that could cause damages to things like satellites and communications worldwide. So it's depending on now this one that's being sent here that we're seeing isn't coming toward Earth that's still off to the edge. But it is quite possible that future ones could come toward Earth, giving us some of those Aurora that we've seen the last time and even causing associated uh, damages here on Earth if they are strong enough. So it's something to keep watching over the next couple of weeks as this turns and ends up facing towards Earth. We'll be able to see a little bit better as it comes around that edge to see how it's grown or how it's begun to shrink as the sunspots will come and go. The sunspot groupings don't last forever. And it's quite possible that this one could still be growing or could have decreased in strength. But from what we're seeing right now, it is still very strong and has the potential to give us some very strong solar flares over the coming weeks. So that was our picture of the day for May 28th of 2024. It was titled Solar X Flare as Famous Active Region Returns. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture previewed to be a stairway too. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day everyone, and I will see you in class.